Hey, did you know that the way you charge your transmitter can impact your experience using the Minimed 780G system? That's right. Let's review some of our best practices for charging. First, make sure to fully charge your transmitter every time you change your sensor. Once charged, your transmitter battery should last up to seven days. Next, we recommend replacing the AAA battery in your transmitter charger frequently. If the light on your charger changes from green to flashing red, it could mean the battery is low. Also, it's a good idea to use a charger that came with your new transmitter instead of using any old ones you may have laying around from a previous system. Let's review the charging process next. First, push the transmitter and gray charger together to start the connection. Second, within a few seconds, a green light on the charger should begin to flash. Third, when your transmitter is done charging, the green light on the charger will stay on without flashing for 15 to 20 seconds and then turn off. Lastly, after the green charger light turns off, take the transmitter off the charger. The green light on the transmitter will flash several times and then turn off. If you don't see the green light flash on the transmitter, place it back on the charger until it is fully charged. By the way, did you know your transmitter has a one-year warranty? That's right. In fact, the use of transmitters beyond one year may lead to reduced battery life, more frequent lost sensor alerts, and more alarms. If you are experiencing a change in your transmitter's performance, call our 24-hour technical support team at 1-800-646-4633 and select option one. They'll help troubleshoot your device. In some cases, simple tips can help improve transmitter performance. Other times, a replacement transmitter will be needed. If it is determined that you need a replacement and depending on your transmitter's warranty, we'll work with you, your healthcare provider, and if needed, your insurance company to help get the order processed. In some cases, we may need you to send us your old transmitter. Don't sweat it. We'll send you some easy to follow instructions so you can get that back to us in no time.